hello friends welcome to my channel and today's video is about this question so the question is like this in the quadrilateral pqrs po and q are the bisectors of angle p and q respectively show that angle poq is equal to half of angle r and s so let's try and understand the question here they are saying this angle particular line this po bisects this entire angle p bisect means it's equally divide this angle into two parts two equal parts right so and this, uh, this line qo bisects this angle q into two equal parts that means i'll just tell you so this po is a bisector of this angle so this will equally divide this and this angle into equal like if i say 1 and 2 so 1 is equal to angle 1 is equal to angle 2 similarly qo is a bisector that means if i call this as 3 and 4 so angle 3 is equal to angle 4 this is called as a bisectors right so now we are supposed to prove that angle poq is equal to this much so first thing is we should know the angle sum properties of both triangle and uh, uh, quadrilateral quadrilateral is any uh, a uh, closed figure with four sides, isn't it? So now let's write by angle sum property. Of triangle. Okay. So the angle sum property of a triangle. Don't mind my writing here. So angle 1 here. And let me call this as angle 5, right? So angle 1 plus angle 3 plus angle 5 here is equal to 180 degrees this is the main angle sum property right so now because it is a bisector now we also know that angle 1 is equal to angle 2 here and angle 3 is equal to angle 4 so now can we say this angle 1 as half of angle p because it is a bisector right this angle is equal to this so that means can i say directly that angle p plus this angle 3 is nothing but half of angle Q. Is that it? And this I'll just replace it here as angle POQ is equal to 180 degrees. Alright. So now this half and half are uh, common between both the terms. Half of angle P plus angle Q. Right. Uh, we'll write here a plus angle POQ is equal to 180 we want this angle p and q so i'm going to shift everything else to the other side of the equation right so now first thing is angle to uh, half of angle p plus angle q okay is equal to 180 minus angle p o q so this is plus it becomes minus when it goes to the other side now angle p plus angle q is equal to this part goes to that side and becomes two times the 180 minus angle p o q all right now by the angle sum property of this triangle we have proved this and we'll call it as equation number one all right so now let's take this by angle sum property of i'll just write angle sum property of quadrilateral so quadrilateral let this let this q be a quadrilateral i'll call it as angle p plus angle q plus angle r plus angle s we know it is any four-sided figure it is 360 degrees the angle sum property but by equation one we can replace angle p plus q here by this right so two times the angle uh, two times the 180 minus angle p o q right plus angle r plus angle s is equal to 360 so i have just replaced this p plus q in this by this equation one okay so now we have to divide this entire equation by two so divide by two so what do we get when we divide this entire equation by two so this is one term this is two term three term four term isn't it so this first term when we divide by two so let me write it here itself so you know two and two get cancelled here we are left with 180 minus angle poq right now between both the things half is i'll take it half outside we are left with angle r plus angle s is equal to 180 degrees all right so now only we have to keep the angle poq because we are supposed to prove this right so and remaining everything i'm going to shift it now tell me observe this equation 180 is here 180 is here so that means we can directly cancel it right because even if it goes that that side it becomes minus so 180 minus 180 is zero so now we have minus poq and this part if i take this to other side what happens i'll just write it here half of angle r 
plus angle s as it is so minus will go to the other side becomes plus and angle poq so this is what we are supposed to prove in this equation that is angle poq is equal to half of angle r plus angle s hence it is proved